This is the middle Marshangdi hydroelectric project, Nepal's second largest hydroelectric project. Middle Marshangdi is a runoff river hydro project with installed capacity of 70 megawatt. Himal Hydro, a leading construction company in Nepal, is playing a major role in the construction of the project. It is the only home company with the necessary expertise and equipment to engage in a major project like this one. The company is involved in the underground and surface drilling works of the dam site of the project. The company undertakes fully mechanized excavation and support work for the power tunnel, bypass tunnel, ventilation tunnel and surge shaft. The lengths of the tunnels range from 110 to 430 meters and their areas vary from 15 to 36 meters squared. Himal Hydro, a leading construction company in Nepal, has undertaken most daring construction works in the country. It has been involved in the country's second largest hydropower project, the Middle Marshangdi Manakamana Cable Car, the first of its kind in the country, and Sunkoshi Hydropower Project, which uses GRP for the first time in the country. Himal Hydro is not only involved in major projects like Middle Marshangdi Hydropower Project and Manakamana Cable Car, it has a glorious history of working for pioneer projects in the country. Tatupani Hydroelectric Project and Tinau Hydroelectric Project are remarkable project among them. The company is a Class A contractor which puts value or quality before anything else. Offering clients supreme value in all aspects of construction like time, cost and quality, it is well ahead of the others in the sector. The company enjoys advantage over others in that it perfectly abides by the quality management principles of ISO 9001-2000. The surge shaft being excavated by Himal Hydro is the largest underground shaft in Nepal. It is 21 meters in diameter and 41 meters high. Alimark raised climber is used for the excavation of the pilot shaft from the bottom to the top and the widening of the shaft is done from the top to the bottom dropping excavated material through the pilot shaft. The company also undertakes major drilling works for open excavation, rock anchor and grouting at dam site. One of the greatest achievements of the company is construction and operation of waste water treatment plant at Hitaura Industrial District, financed by Danida. In association with MT Hoggard of Denmark, and under strict supervision of Kobe Consult Engineering Denmark, Himal Hydro recently completed the overall design, construction and operation contract for the plant. The industrial and sanitary wastewater from industries and building undergo treatment in the plant before it is discharged into the Kara River.
The design process capacity of the plant is 1,100 cubic meter per day. The plant complies with the affluent criteria set by the Ministry of Population and Environment. The treatment method used by the plant is a proven stable process. It consists of combination of anaerobic and aerobic flow through lagoons. The plant uses both mechanical and biological treatment methods. The mechanical treatment plant at HID consists of metal screens, grid chambers, ONG trap and emergency tank. The biological treatment is done through anaerobic and aerobic lagoons. The effluent goes through the anaerobic and then to aerobic lagoons. The treatment plant has pollutant reduction capacity of 15 folds for BOD and 18 folds for suspended particles. Next, Himal Hydro's important project is Glacier Lake Outburst Flood GLOF, Risk Reduction Project for Chorolpa, the largest glacier lake of Nepal. The company reduced immediately and tangibly the water level in Chorolpa by minimum of 3 meters and eliminated the risk of breach forming in a natural moraine dam at the glacier lake. This reduced the risk of glof occurring downstream in the Rolwaling, Tamakoshi and Bhotikoshi in Dolakha district. It saved the life and properties worth billions of dollars. The project included construction of an open channel, trapezoidal in cross section with 6.4 meters width at the bottom and designed to cater 14.6 cubic meters per second discharge. Gate structure is designed to regulate the water flow if necessary. Another major achievement of Himal Hydro is Manakamana cable car, the only cable car in the country. For a country like Nepal, where building roads is very expensive, the cable car can be a great relief and time saver. This cable car carries hundreds of devotees and religious tourists to the famous temple of Manakamana in Gorkha district each year. The 3 km cable car project was constructed under strict supervision of Doppler Meyer of Austria. The most challenging part of the construction was transportation of reassembled parts by helicopter and erecting them directly on the foundation. This method was used for the first time in Nepal and was highly successful. 13 towers were erected within 6 hours. The company is also proud of completing the first GRP pipe used hydropower project. It is 2.5 megawatt Sunkoshi hydropower project. Sanima Hydropower, the investor of the project, gave the responsibility of constructing the project to Himal Hydro, which in turn completed it in time without compromising in quality. The power plant is connected to the national grid. Sunkoshi intake is boulder riprap type of intake which seems an appropriate design because of sediments and boulder carrying nature of rivers in Nepal. The water is channeled into the powerhouse through 2 km long glass reinforced pipe GRP. The water is led into the approach canal from the intake. Since its establishment in 1978, Himal Hydro has successfully completed construction of small and medium scale projects. 60 MW Kimthi First Hydropower Project and 14 MW Modi Hydroelectric Project 
are yet other feathers on the hat of the company. Another area Himal Hydro has specialized in is the installation of transmission line. It has constructed more than 300 kilometers of 33 to 132 kV transmission lines. This includes 60 kilometers transmission line of 132 kV in Modi and Chimbro projects. Yet another area Himal Hydro boasts of its unchallenged capability in Nepal is the construction of ropeways. It built many ropeways in distant areas like Chimrup, Adikola, Gorkha Barpak passenger and material ropeways of various lengths and carrying capacity. The company designed and conducted the feasibility study of more than half a dozen of ropeways in remote areas, including one in the remotest part of Nepal, the Karnali zone. It built Kimti hydroelectric project with an installed capacity of 60 megawatt. It was completed in 2000 ahead of schedule despite tremendous geological, logistical and other local problems. The project contains a gross head of 684 meters through a total waterway length of 10 kilometers at the rated flow of 10.7 cubic meters per second. The project has been praised for its excellent compliance with strict health, safety and environmental standards. The company completed the Chimbrook hydroelectric project with a capacity of a 12 megawatt in Pewtan district. The work was activated during the period of 1989 to 1994. 5.1 megawatt of Adikola hydroelectric project is also another pride of Himal Hydro. This project includes headrace tunnel of 1,284 meters, tailrace tunnel of 1,080 meters, and drop shaft for powerhouse 245 meters. Khudi hydroelectric project is another milestone in construction circle for Himal Hydro. 2.5 km long steel pen stock pipe is being laid to deliver water to the powerhouse. The boulder lined wire is being built to divert water through the intake by inlet canal and dill silting basin. Himal Hydro is taking challenge to construct this project on time and quality. Himal Hydro has also equally exhibited its expertise in building roads and bridges. 25 km Jiri Palati Road, a 22 km Nayapul Kirne Road, and an underground road and pavement for Kimthi project are its telling achievements. It has also built numerous steel, RCC, and suspension bridges. Through its quality work, Himal Hydro has won high credibility among clients and partners. Poti Koshipao Company BKPC has entrusted Himal Hydro with maintenance of Poti Koshi transmission line. This contract is the first of its kind in Nepal. The responsibility BKPC has entrusted on Himal Hydro is testimony of its reliability, the evidence that it has the necessary manpower and skill to meet the very demand of ensuring uninterrupted power supply to the national grid. Himal Hydro draws its strength from skilled human resource and a large fleet of equipment to do the work. It possesses various types of plants and equipment worth millions of dollars. The company keeps the equipment well maintained in its own heavy plant workshops and equipment yards. The major equipment possessed by Himal Hydro are Alimark Race Climber, Crawl Drilling Machines, Jumbo Boomer Drill Rigs, Short Crater Robots, Tire Changer, Excavators,
scoop trams, tower cranes, batching plants, screening plants, rock rushes, generators and many more. Not only is Himal Hydro equipped with machines, it has also a large stock of spare parts so that maintenance can take place within no time. The equipments under the ownership of the company are also available for renting. Himal Hydro has the manpower of highly skilled and experienced engineers, foremen, mechanics, electricians and administrative staff. As the company lays stress on training its employees, the manpower is always kept at the cutting edge of compositeness. The organizational structure is one of the most scientific and efficient. The board of directors of international repute oversees the management of the organization. Reputed as the country's most trusted company, Himal Hydro has strategic objectives of continuing with construction of hydropower, tunneling, water and wastewater and other infrastructure works as its core business. The company also has the strategic objectives of building and owning power plants with the aim of selling power to the national grid. It also has the objective of operating an equipment, rental and maintenance business, construction related production and service business. The company will continue to operate and realize hydropower investment plans. It will always be driven by the desire to excel in the activities it has been conducting. All these strategic objectives come forth in realizing the broader vision of becoming a leading company in building up the economy of Nepal. Nepal has huge potential for generating hydropower and there is a great need of power as the country makes progress towards industrialization. Moreover, a vast market in the neighboring country makes it possible to export the surplus Nepal can generate. But funding hydropower projects is a major obstacle. Experience shows that until and unless local resource and local capability is used to the fullest extent, we can never get affordable power nor will we be able to export it to our neighbors. Given the opportunity, a company like Himal Hydro could play a major role in the development of affordable hydropower in Nepal. Himal Hydro has repeatedly proven it can successfully complete major and daring constructions. Going by its long list of achievements, Himal Hydro has contributed tremendously in nation building. These development infrastructures have fueled Nepal's economy.